very No point in Which excuse the whole market and colony. Um. About five hundred. About five hundred. I don't have a total on that sheet, but. Quick math, about 500. That was the point where I should start buying holy water. A lot of it. That. 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 I was going to talk to Dammit again. I forgot. It's fine. Also depends on when Spa is killed since the fight ends after he dies. Uh, I didn't end for me when I did it. Um, this is what? Two weeks ago? Something like two weeks ago? I killed Spa before finishing the combat, and I was still in combat with like the, the guards from the um the side on the fast travel. But perhaps I did something different. That gets me. Alson also, also has only 10 strength, his muscles are for show. Yeah, Gale is like equally toned with 8 strength, and that's a wizard who's referred to as not strong. Gale just doesn't have the, the big frame that Alson does. Alson also has no axe, so Astarian has him beat there. I'm allowed to say that as as a non ass having person. You know that this will do wonders for the shop. Ruby, no point in lingering now. I've got the noble stock. All the rest of clerk. We basically want enough money to buy Nair Misser, Ring of Reaction, Risky Ring. Um, Fistbreaker Helm. All of that as soon as humanly possible. I'm gonna take it a dip, use Dwarven Thor in Act 3. Uh, maybe. 
Welcome maybe. Back. I do enjoy a good bargain. The thing with Act 3 is, is bloodthirst is, is right there. Like, sure, it's behind Orin, but level 11, reliable talent, Orin's a meme. Bloodthirst. Oh yeah, Dwergar get Warhammer proficiency. Right. Problem is, can't sneak attack it. I'd have to dual wielder and offhand it. I'd have to offhand it if I still wanted to sneak attack on my throws. But I'll probably take dual wielder anyway, so. Let's get Shield of Faith from Gut. What to do? Eat. Come. No, I need to actually pick a fight. Um. Because I want the mats for a Vigilance Elixir. I don't want to have to rely on the one that's in that chest. Wish I had a bag of hope. So I do need to kill one of these Hokoros, if not two. to initiative. I need 18 decks so they can't outspeed me. Even if they outspeed, it'll be surprised. As long as I don't pull that group of them, it'll be fine. See. Yeah, I did win initiative. Swift as my feet can carry me. I should hex. I'm not going to hex. I will likely get punished for this. I forgot to pick up my hammer, didn't I? Who did I throw that out? One of the paladins, right? Probably should have hid. I also forgot to shield the thralls. Uh, I'm willing to commit resources here. Maybe pull this one without aggroing everyone else, but I am less optimistic about that. Never wanted the easy path. Hammer, right? I'll go grab it in a minute. Where guard just shovel with weapons? Yes. See how you respond. You won't go down. You'll just hide there. And if I jump there to fight you, I'm in a position where I can't pull out. Uh, so, yeah, cut my losses. 
Guess I will have to rely on the, the vigilance pot that I didn't want to. Moving ahead. Knowing when to cut and run is important for a run like this. See you I threw my hammer at? Where, where, where did I where did I throw that thing? Is the, the name of it? I, I definitely don't have it. Throw it at you. Uh, like, if I lose that, it'll be mildly annoying, because maybe that smite could have been good and trade wasn't trolling me the whole time. Uh, I remember the last time I threw that. I don't. That specific enemy I feel is placed uh, out of range of most attacks. You have to commit. Yeah, good enemy placement. Good check the combat log, I guess. Or are you throwing the ogre in the barn? I've had it since then, though. Throw it with a strange ox? No. You. You. When is the last time I had this? This is why people like bound weapons so much. I'll be able to get lightning jabbers in the Shadow Curse lands, and that'll be real nice. Skybreaker. Okay. I did. I did throw it at Zero. I was right. It's just not here. Okay, the game just ate it, I guess. I did remember correctly. It's just gone. Okay. Back down by the water? Sure. I think it kept going. Did I ever loot the backpack by Carlac? We'll check while we're over here. Oh, wait. How are you here? Has this happened to you? Oh, oh, I see the other message. Thunder wave. Right, when I did the thunder wave. I read those out of order. Right. Okay. I did grab that. Good detective work. Uh, we can go do harpies. I don't need to do that. Save the goblin. Wait, Saza's still there? That's got to be a bug quest marker. That is not there. Oh, she doesn't die instantly now if you clear the camp? Huh. How badly do I want Kaga's amulet? I don't want it. I don't want to attack her until the druids on top of the gate are dead. So it can wait. Have a lot on my mind. Might be optimal XP freer after dealing with Mandara. Makes a certain amount of sense. Oh, hey, my jagged spear. Pockets. Trail of throwables. Is 
you just chilling in here? No, she's dead. No, she's she she's dead. Oh, thanks for the thanks for the update. I forgot to I forgot to kill her. Oh, missed out on 20 XP because of that. Oh well. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that that walk. Let's go to Mount Pass. Now, we did not do the Raphael Manip, so we will not have that XP or that beating him up. But I like shaking it up sometimes. I got patch 5, I had that quest marker even after finding your dad. I see. I'm debating whether I just kill Esther right away. I probably want the Scorching Ray Gloves. Probably want Cacophony. I definitely want Graceful Claw. I don't need to kill her right now. I'm going to eventually, but I could buy from her. Like, especially with um, how good my sleight of hand is. Esther is a pretty free steal, right? As long as I just keep enough initiative. Pave my path with corpses. Build my castle with bones. Like from here, I just jump up here, run over here, flee combat. Yeah, Esther lives for a while. Not long, but a while. I can go for the persuade with friends. Who goes there? What's up for discussion? Ah, Reason is there to give her an owlbear egg? Not. I don't give her the egg oh, ever. You are a sweet, you know. Look over there. Use. Uh, you'll be well compensated, Amy. of course. Just bring me an egg. Hey. Trust that an early payment has ensured swift action. What news of the Gith Yankee egg? I think I'll. I mean, I could try to steal it. Now we'll consider this an investment. I'll buy this, and that will help me steal better to to steal other things. Yeah. So at 18 decks, I have plus 4. So I will always outspeed anything that doesn't have an initiative bonus. Favorite track in the game? It's so good, Penny. That also improves my accuracy with my hand crossbows. Which will be pretty relevant. Always room for more. Uh, do I want to get any of the stuff down there? I guess I could use Dwergar and Large. Advantage on this. Mattered. That was tough. This can't have been used in a while. I'm gonna back up my save because elevators. Just save some time for the loodles along the path. There's also mines that I don't have the positions memorized. So like repulsion mines that'll just throw you into the pit. And because I don't remember where those are, uh, for this. Do 
Rhaegar features are so good. Like, you get a lot to cover a lot of different areas, like what you need. Good mix of defense, offense, utility. Good stuff. I'd go for the Grimishka here. As long as I'm careful about AoEs, I don't wake up the kobolds downstairs. You can even see them through like this crack. My amazing hand crossbow damage. I don't need any Boost attention. movement speed result in any risky positions yet? No, because I'm investing a lot to movement speed gear. Movement ring, movement helmet, movement boots, bonus action dash. Shouldn't have used sneak attack there, but it's fine, I think. All right, then. Doesn't know how to handle the Death Stalker mantle in this. That's a friendly looking shadow. Are you always critting? So having advantage um makes the higher outcome of two rolls. So because I'm rolling twice every time, pretty good chance of, of critting. But uh, assassin features against anything that's surprised, you always crit. So, that crit in round two was luck. All the crits in here were assassin. Like this. See, it doesn't even show that it crit here, but it was a crit because assassin. Advantage and lowering the crit range can get you much closer to like 1 in 8 instead of 1 in 20 for crit chances. Yeah. Very effective. I don't want to Alchemist Fire and sneak attack that. Don't know. That should work. Step is the hardest. Softer than a whisper. Fire still. I can get Death Stalker's mantle off of that. Hope this ends well. Or off of that. That works too. And now they're going here to look for me. 
probably detect me. Maybe they don't, though. I can just get a new surprise round if they don't. Or not. Oh, well. Yeah, I should have waited for a turn tech. That's fine. You're still burning over there. So are you. You'll both die to that in lightning charges. Alice Low is probably going to be a priority. Not only do we want Radiant damage for dealing with Shadows in Act 2, um, it'll be additional damage for whenever we make something bleed or light them on fire. Um, and it helps out the bomb tech. With Callus Glow, I can pretty safely go one bomb the Spectator. It'll be a decent injection of XP, I suppose. Just take that necrotic resist elixir through the bars, because of course you can. Can't keep me out. I should have an elixir on right now. I think I have Colossus elixirs to spare. Eagles will have to wait a good long while. I'll want Mighty Claw. Before I deal with them. Looks like a Githyanki if the armor is anything to go by. It's exploration XP for this, right? Light on my feet. Go up top. Don't wanna piss off the Eagles, just gonna walk by. Burger and large apply to thrown weapons. Uh, so enlarge applies to any weapon attacks and throws and unarmed. So punching, throwing, bows, melee weapons—they all get that D4 on all of their their stuff. And since that's a dice roll, it does get uh, doubled up by crits. What's hiding here? Well, and all of the bonuses do in that particular vein. Um. It's nice because it matches the damage type of what you're applying it to. So if you're, say, attacking something that has vulnerability, it feeding into that number is sometimes better than getting something that is just its own number. Like, um, the acid ring, the two acid damage ring on weapon attacks, that's just going to be two acid damage. But if I have this, well, that can be up to eight or more on a crit. Burger seems perfect for this run. Dwergar Dirge is like absolutely suited to this run in a way very few other things even could be. Asarian works well for it. Um I think those are the, the top contenders. In the beginning, too. Out of mind. His happy buff gives him uh, plus one to all dice rolls. Well, all attack rolls, skill checks, saving throws, all those. So you're just slightly better at everything. Um, you can also take minor illusion with your high elf cantrip instead of having to do a class dip for it. Also, bite is once per short rest bonus action damage that has no save, no attack roll, it's just if you are in range and can bite them, damage. And and that has saved me a couple times.
Guardian of Faith spell. Something to prevent this guy from appearing when the first room's room is empty. Uh, sounds like a bug. I don't know of anything that prevents this guy from appearing, but uh, maybe I just haven't seen that. And here, every run for me. Why does Nightbot keep thanking us for testing? It's sort of an inside joke, monkey. Um, but basically, uh, some of the theory crafting minded friends of the channel just a, a joke where anytime there's a mechanics question the answer would be hey thank you for testing as in like hey that's a good question you go test that and report back to me so anytime you start a message with a does nightbot will say that Within the artifact, a feeling stirs. Uncertainty. Your curiosity. I almost came down here too fast. They were still fighting. It. it could have been Stay awkward. Stay away from the Githyanki. They're hunting you. The blood they of want the artifact. Nightbot really do it every time. There's a cooldown. They'll stop at nothing. Nightbot's doing something wrong. else. But... Here for all to worship. Funny because I wasn't going to go out of my way to check the Hagsbane thing yesterday that I saw the Nightbot thing. I was like, huh, I do have a save nearby. See, it's productive. Something good here. I hope. We can get crush access now, but I want to go over here and get the Vigilance pot. Maybe kill some kobolds too. You could also just go through the side door and like in just past the people who don't want you to be there. But I haven't practiced that a huge amount, so not gonna. does incentivize testing. Reductive. Reductive shit posts. Alright, I'm gonna AFK for a couple minutes. We're not gonna go too much longer, you know, another hour and a half tops, but uh, I'm gonna grab some food real quick. BRB.
I have some leftover chicken. I just kind of grabbed from the fridge and put it in my mouth. We're good now. I got energy. I've done very few crafts. That Vigilance Elixir that I was stressing out over, it's so that I have a chance to outroll Karnas if I roll high, he rolls low. Otherwise, I have no chance at all. The plan is not to fight Karnas. The plan is to get him to give us the Lantern with a Deception check. So let's go to Shadow Curse Lens. Even Glutter Team Spa. I mean, Blood is turning on the individual who took him in when he needed help. So, fuck Glut. On the other hand, I just leave the quest undone so that I can use Glut to revive things to buff me throughout the run. Every time you hear Karnas, I think Katniss Everdeen, and it sucks. Does Karnas have a bow? I don't think he does. Here, Glot summons. I use Priestess Gut, because Priestess Gut has a version of Shield of Faith that lasts until long rest. It's just 2 AC. You can just keep doing this until you lose access to the Act 1 map. You can even have it active through the, the Act finale. And it even triggers things like um, the Dark Justicia armor that wants you to have Shield of Faith active. Chance you retain among your... Really good stuff. Um, my thanks. El I, I hope you... Why? Some... I'm here on behalf of Mistra. The Mistra is aware of the misadventures that have to... That is why I have come here to... You must find... The... To you, I commit into no. power. Fuck you, Elminster. I'll take that. I say, actor during Merkel, it does. It does. I'd have hoped to introduce you to him in less dire. Time seems so infinite when you're young, and I, along with it, I had that remains ahead of us for now. Go grab the shark water and the shark wart. Fuck Elminster and Mistra on side. So, Elminster is not okay with what Mistra is having Gale do. He's actually upset if Gale does it. But he's still delivering the message. So, yeah, fuck that guy. <laughs> he's doing something he knows isn't right. Curse lands. I think I have the um Arna stuff down pretty well. I saved Barkus, right? Yeah, yeah, I did. Ride for my boy Gale, and that I'll never forgive. Amen. <laughs> Time to rest. 
And forgot to apply that. There you go. Mark of the shifter. Absolutely protected me. You're holding my lantern. Where is the lantern? Battle 35. What? Go. This is not Her Majesty's will. Brow option. Cool. Shadow curse protection. That's the sound. Harness and the boys gone. the way when I am hurting night and day. Did me a good turn there, didn't you? What do I owe you? Sure, you protect your way. Fix it. Got home from work. Welcome home, Moo. How was your day? Are you live? Because I have bills to pay. <laughs> The honest reason. Also, this is fun. Oh, our ship's no food breaks or bathroom breaks. USA! USA! from these. I'm gonna want that. I need blind protection first. Very this is a very high priority ring. I need blind protection first. The morgue. I forget to get that shadow battlefield. Ah, I totally did. That's fine. What's inside? Bad way to go. I fault overbook myself because I don't want to say no to money because I'm poor. That's relatable. Seven customers back to back. And 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 you're talking about me being live for too long. What are you doing? This place is protected. $50. I support you everything. Here, or at least you are absolutely correct. shadows here 
Something must be keeping it at bay. You there! Who are you? Just keep your you here. Once you're pleased to meet you. And the hell is that? Get up, tell me. Settle. Shouldn't hang around too long, though. Just about. Like a good moment to talk. Stock up while you can. I only hope I've brought enough to see us through. Free camp supplies, we take those. If you're all right by Jahira, I don't know how much switch fades, right but I know it's me. not enough. Well, it's what I have as an option right now. So, uh. I do what I can. Need that. The rest of this is expensive. Hold on, kick. No, you know that's not happening. Shield could save me. The thing was, I don't need cloak of protection right now. I'm gonna want it for a few things, but that doesn't have to be right now. Shade Clinger armor is something I should prioritize. I buy bombs and scrolls from people I get better prices from. Buy this for now. Take care. Already act two? Yeah. We uh we're leaving some underdark and mountain pass stuff for later. And if you find uh, when if you find it, bring it to me. Absolutely. Need anything? It's per um but getting access to last light and moonrise. Need anything? Opens up a lot of high priority vendors. Sort of clutching umbra is something we might use. I can sell dark vision scrolls. I'll be here if you need it. Act 2 is not hard to get to early, almost right after the Goblin Quest. That Dwergar made this easier. Yeah, just invis past the uh, Death Shepherds. It's pretty free. We love Act 2 Damon for his free money armor. We sure do, monkey. We sure do. Immediately right next to Tally, so you can sell his armor to her immediately. Yeah, I won't sell the Tally, because... Uh, I want to sell to Lantarv or Blurg or Dareth. Preferably Lantarv, because I will kill Lantarv later and get the armor back to sell it again. Um, but I want to sell it to someone I have good attitude with off the bat. Come on, open up. Sell that.
No idea there's expensive armor right there. Yeah, Trade told me about that one a while ago, and I was like, what? It's a uh, good money injection. Early financial stuff in Act 2 and 3 is really fun to optimize. Because you can get so much money so quickly. I want anything from in here. I ain't my neck of the woods. <laughs> Count your lucky stars. Figuring out if I want to talk to Raphael or not. I think I could get a Starian approval by having him with me here, but I don't think I need that. It'll need to go to camp. Put him in for. Uh, I did miss the. No reason not to. I allow that. Tell me you're a Sharon. Something. <sighs> it's just positive. You can trust me on that. I was. He mentioned Dark Justicias, and we've come across other signs of a Sharon. Must we? Thank you. I'm sure we'll get along perfectly well. well she's, she's not telling me. Um. Yeah, let's, let's bring a star and go talk to Raphael. I'm a wander far. The keen gleam in Maul's eyes for the What she cheated, of course. But that's half. But uh, this hmm. oh, don't premium trinkets and I already had Max inspiration, so whatever. It's always a pleasure to see <laughs> Go away. Um will Floric still be here because I went to camp? Oh no, she's talking, I can hear. Hi, Flora. Sorry, and just comes in here, okay. We need a way into the towers. I intend He still won't nothing is him. We believe the cultists have taken Duke Ray. I'll request that Lord Gortash uh, free invis pot, potion of greater healing. We leave the hand crossbow, so our boy Art will pick it up. Though, so, honestly, what if I moved it? What if I just left it here? Don't nice. be shy. Check it out. I'm gonna get the sword off, Jonas. Ah, I forgot. Me in charge. Oopsie. Not get Raph's armor. I didn't do this wrong. Nope. I chose not to. do it i think uh as far as i'm aware the ambush won't be over there or Jonas's corpse I wish we, had bloody army. we can we can go check i have a vigilance this fair enough oh wait hang on i was using that colossus carry weight whoopsie whoops whoopsie He's planning for this run. Switch between Graceful Cloth, Mighty Cloth as is necessary. Probably some Ballist armor use in Act 3.
Oh, the Thousand Warlock? Yeah, I took a one-level Warlock dip for uh, Minor Illusion and uh, things like that. Oh, the arrow wasn't fast enough. go up there yet. This is where the Jonas thing would be happening, and it's not happening. Take the Night Orchid, though. Mind if I do. I forgot to get the Shadow Battlefield. Leave me, leave me alone. Uh, next thing is getting access to Moonrise. We have to buy a Nair Misser. Which I should have enough. By vendoring things to Lantar. Uh, there's a bunch of tadpoles to be had there as well. Good XP. Probably a level six soon. That's a friendly looking shadow. What am I doing? I'm a Dwarkar. We can grab three tadpoles basically for free as soon as we get to Moonrise, although one of these days I'm going to fail the rolls on Lincella and that whole thing's going to play out differently. Um, I need the Infernal Iron from the Mason's Guild for the Blood Held Us Gloves. mask for intimidation checks. Let's have a look. We'll probably do the thorns somewhat early. I have Deception, Expertise, and Intimidation Proficiency. Deception should make Garengoth simple. Intimidation for Malice. Uh, Thisabald will be trickier. An Old Fowler Lou for plus one performance, but performance checks will be tricky. Does Dirge have a Thisabald related inspiration? There would probably have one to drink, right? Stone fragments. Mason's worked here. The plus your strength potion? Yes. I looked up a post with the exact dialogue options you need to get it without him dumping you. Yes. Hopefully that works. Be the fishing pole of awareness. True. my uh plot held us gloves very good stuff very very big deal gonna want the knock scroll from underneath the mason's guilds for when it's time to go feed balthazar to the dark justiciers probably do that like first thing tomorrow Talk to Arabella right now. Please, 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 Don't want to deal with these right now either. So we're 
we're just gonna do funny Dwergar things and walk around everything. I'm gonna go get the Road to Baldur's Gate uh, fast travel. I should go get the short sword for advantage and stealth. Nah, I have Graceful Cloth. I don't need that now. Means I also don't need Gloves of Savory on my bar anymore. Let's plot seven sleight of hand. That's without guidance or mark of the shifter active, and also without smuggler's ring on. Uh, that's like and gloves of power. I could have all that on. Good enough to consistently steal a lot of things, actually. If the ambush shouldn't trigger. I haven't done the mountain pass story, so no, it's not there yet. We're close. I can feel it. The absolute. Its power is strong here. Zora will pop up in a second here. They're locked up in the cult's fortress. Sounds. Oh, I failed the perception check. Okay, can't get Will out of his contract. That's a DC 5 and I failed. I've never failed that before. We learned something interesting. Ah, my apologies. Welcome back, true soul. You'll find Zarel in the... Pray Cursed to put my hands on everything. There can be no doubt. This is the place. This is land the discover the secrets of the, the absolute. Want to see. If you have coin, then show it. Ah! The absolute needs warriors for prove it. Who's singing your name? Check makes it camp very well. I failed a perception check to like sense that Mizora was actually in distress. Um, so I assume well, I, I wasn't able to take the option to to tell Mizora I'll do it if you free will from his pact. So like, now it's just a mission with no reward. Apparently, Want anything from my stash? It might still play you out. Pay less than the rest. In a favorable way for Will. We'll see. Uh, we'll see. I'm so funny. Blessing Short Sword is probably worth buying. I can use that to apply bleed. Um, I can get a surprise round by poking with that and then have bleed for a Bolal's Benediction. Although, hmm. I would already have advantage. I could poke from invisibility. Yeah, that's still valuable. We'll hold off on purchasing it for now, but that is still valuable. Nailed it. Glad you appreciated the, the joke. Brothers. Sister. The absolute war drums beat loud in your chest. How may I serve? Entire brother, I need you to have more money. I have to do some rest so he gets money. He doesn't have enough to buy the stuff that I want to sell. Where, where is my pick up and add to wares button? Why does it sometimes exist and sometimes it doesn't? his money to buy his stocks. 
should maybe consider stealing from him. War drums beat loud in your chest. How may I serve? Might be honest on there. Uh, I won't be able to sell Blood Helldust to him until um, he has enough money. Once the spirit sounds like a skill issue. Once again, you're correct. How can I be of service, true soul? Calm down with this inventory row. It's a little too cracked. I need, I need to process this. It's a little too cracked. There's like a lot happening here. Okay, so Nair Misser is priority one. You cost exactly 2,000 gold. You get money from Mirage. Provided we pass some checks. Bergar might have a favorable option. have stopped working. Door.exe. Should you be interested? With one drop, I can brew rather pot- No one gave it to me. Rather I run research, naturally. No we can learn exactly what that means. Well, that's why we're trading, no? Please. Failed all the checks. I will re I oh, I didn't get money. Hopefully someone else in the party will succeed the checks. What was the added provision to saving throws until you succeed on three of them or take a long rest? Oh, that's pretty good for, uh... Arkle. I like it. Bring Will, Gale, and Astarian. The gods. She makes a mockery of everything. Either we find it, or I made a mindless blob clawing it deep. And I always knew what my future held. That. Why this one is also named Traveler's Chest? It bugs me. What's on your mind? You need to be careful about resting inside of Act Two. Just remembering that I'm Dirge. Oh, we'll frequent travel back to Act One to rest. It's always a pleasure to see you. St <laughs> That orb seems powerful. What can it do once it's extracted? I never th you but, uh, and he's yours to command. Uh, good uh, to feel that uh, it's so bright. Uh, okay. uh, can't you talk some sense into your obstinate child? Uh, because there's something wrong with her blood. Uh, uh, no. Ooh. Who has a potion in their inventory? Where, where, where is it? Also, Gail, get that shit off your bar. It's making me nervous. Any strength on me now? No desire. Should you be interested, ah, I have yes. a particular offer I'd like to make. 
my my tired brain did American spelling. With one drop, I'd go among the many crimes. There so we let go. me adjust my Thank you, Gail. Now, because of Gale, we get money from each of these. Should you be interested with one drop? The pride of the gate. Should you be interested with one drop? I... All's well that ends. Oh, not as bad as it could have. Mind never quiet. Uh, mm, Raphael's angling for the. Uh, and should that come to pass? Are you sure? Oh, well. And. How can you are fastened? Yes. I question. I'll be in. Uh, I. Uh, well. And now, thanks to that money. Time to press ahead. We go by Nair Misser. And we go over to Lincella and get her tadpole. Color, honor, etc. Yeah. What's up for discussion? Ever at your service. I don't want to buy Drake through it as well, but that can wait. And now we get once per short rest. Level 3 Magic Missile, but more importantly, our sneak attack on our throws is now going to be force damage. Because our main hand ranged weapon is force damage. Very, very desirable. Eventually. Uh, so I'll have a little more to land The absolute war drums beat loud in your chest. How miss? Go get the free stuff over here. No traps, please. Do I care about Lantar's limited inventory? Not really. This is a Lincella thing. Stick your hand in. Oh, upgrade old one, maybe. Problem is, if you do that, you get, like, depending on how you do it, you get, uh, until long rest, dislocated shoulder. Disadvantage on attacks, which is really problematic for Rogue. Now, that is the gift the absolute gave. What would you like him to do? You feel no, Barnabas. We talked about this. I have bad wisdom. I don't expect to get this, but we're gonna try anyway. There's no lithid parasite in that core. I'll try to look many, many die. So the the gnolls won't attack you if you're dirge. Out of sight, out of mind. Uh, but I want to attack them. First step is the hardest. They have unique arrows. Their XP. Armed arrows. Not many of those in the game. Sonic 
backlash. Wonder if the gods are watching me. So now we go back to last light. Get the gloves from Damon, and we talk to Roland, and we go save Roland again over by Moonrise. So that we can then go through the prison to the docks, get the barrel that has two more tadpoles in it. Need anything? Well. I stick with those for now. Getting Balthazar's Moon Lantern would also be sensible, actually. I can wait. Maybe. Afford racial passive for damage on critical plot of throne. Nope, just melee. Best bargain, right here. Still very good, but you're just here, melee. I didn't say if you're here to save the day again. Carl and Leo are taken in by your crap. You says melee, but you're right to be skeptical. You're, you're right to be skeptical. Uh, unfortunately, in this particular instance, based on my testing, it uh, does what it says it does. Should mind my step. Never wanted the easy path. Shadows are tricky. You're frightened. That makes it less tricky. I don't want to be invisible. Mortal reminder, doing work. advantage. God damn it all! Instead, I found... I've... And he's using his torch. Amazing. Very fun way to become visible again. Yeah, it's a free action, so... Fuller up most of the item descriptions in this game, so be warned, not every item comes with a free brass dragon. I love the idea of Bolo being the reason why a lot of the stuff just doesn't line up. The fun tongue in cheek way to explain that away. Look at the docks are right here. Best be on my way. I'll go this way. Anything of use? Got my featherfall boots. Follow his make the liar of BG3. Yeah, pretty much. The sweet talk the doc. Oh, uh, in the crash. Or who are we referring to? Uh, making this guy take a swim is a dirge inspiration. This feels like it stretch all the way to the Sea of Swords in a clear day. But there'll be another along soon. Not as the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. 
A shadow as you bear to have. The worms. <laughs> oh, uh, malice. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna. Not right now, but I'm going to. Place. Now, in the crush, we'll use one on Perilous Stakes, one on Repulsor. Keep one for after Zathisk. How much further can I go? Zarel and all that. I never learned the word. Yes, you did. She gives them to me. Oh, yeah, I'm invisible. I was like, why is nothing happening? Considering all that is at stake, considering how the you failed to retrieve the artifact. You failed as the jet. He smirks as everything and nothing at once. I know exactly who you... What? I'm... You heard the general. The goblins are yours. They pick... Please! You gotta help me! For old time's sake! Egg choke die. Do that. Says something to do with this nothing. The seat of the absolute's power. Occupied by a general that cannot be killed. Yes, I could have waited to do that after using up some inspiration points. But there's enough dirge inspiration that I haven't about his power. grabbed yet, and then I'm like, it. And uh, it is XP. I'd like to pass checks with Zarel so I don't have to deal with her bodyguard. This assassinating Zarel will be difficult enough. I should speak up. General Thorne's prayer even you. Excellent. The gob no. Um, oh, I like you. Pledge. Every emotion soaks into her mind's palette. But there is purpose to her exploration. You see 21. Okay, we just get a 22. It's easy. There is a she gave me everything I Show me. That I That's it. Okay, bodyguard's dead. The but we have lost contact with him. Hardly a surprise. It is something that General Thorne desires and that he has ordered I us didn't to pass retrieve. That check. But something good here. I hope. I didn't pass the check to get access to Lantar's expanded inventory. Okay, Zarel with that wiggle. Okay, calm down. So why are you here? Oh, good. It is. She's suddenly nervous, on edge. Talking about the relic makes her anxious. I will burn inspiration on this. General Thorne will not leave Moonrise without it. Fine. Talk to the bugbear Quartermark. Okay. Hey. 
we got the Moon Lantern. Using to reveal shadows a lot. Right tool will do the trick. Thunder trash. This That's XP next time we talk to Lazel. Not gonna open this yet. I want the Shadow Lantern, but it can wait. Hmm. What's that? Zarel reading your mind, consider the touch of a woman. That's the most gamer question. You you okay, Irish? You good, buddy? Easy 32. It's easy. I do want to pass back on Squire. Get some damage in first, because as far as I am aware, Squire doesn't heal. The general's private quarters. Saluting is the option. Just be about your. If the looting is only DC six. Wasn't sure how much lower it was. I knew it was lower, but like that's that's a lot lower. Is this or anything? A bludgeoning volume. Add Gale to my party when I read that. That's a sage inspiration, I believe. Breathe deep and move. May as well benefit. What's on your mind? Catherine's wife. Go ahead. I'm listening. I I'll be. Helldusk, that'll be fire damage, and uh, yes, I know the, the necrotic part is supposed to be on unarmed, but it does the fire damage from the weapon, and then the bleed from the unarmed part, the throwing. Throwing's cursed. I don't know why it is the way it is. Buggy? Yes, you are. So, bludgeoning, piercing, slashing resists. Because my sneak attack is uh, force damage, I should be able to still do a good chunk here. Seems like the best way. 
good 16. Me hex you. Should have done that ahead of time, but fine. close the door and back time up. To press ahead. curse. Right. Where I put all my plus one daggers? That's an oopsie. Maybe I should. No. This is good. Uh, hopefully, this doesn't just kill me. Ow. Why did Ketzerik put a tongue monster in his daughter's bedroom? Anyone, uh... Anyone figure that one out yet? Lazel about one disc. Um, Isabel needed after Alan was kidnapped. Ah, I see. Maybe she put it there. <laughs> ah, okay. You're right. Judgment is not a good look. I should do the fight out front of the morgue. Uh, hmm. I'm just not quite sure how I want to deal with... Oh, actually, I have an idea. I have an idea. Maybe it snuggles real well. Fair point. speed up getting knife of the under mountain king that would be smart
Like the invis just in time. Lantern strats, yeah. Got it from you. Got it from you. Others had mentioned the Moon Lantern before, but I'd never seen it in action, and yeah, I'm a believer now. You're no longer surprised. You're very throwable, though. Hope this ends well. Need to find a way forward. Good job, Shovel. Wretched thing. Pull yourself together. The reason why this is important because this ring. Shadow Cloak Ring, where its weapon and un unarmed attacks deal an additional 1d4 damage against lightly or heavily obscured creatures and creatures made of shadow. One, that's almost everything in this act. Two, this applies to throw. Three, this applies separately to throw damage and tavern brawler throw damage. See if it works with bombs. I don't think it does, but maybe it's it's different in how the game views it from Ring of Flinging, so it's possible. Oh, 
Uh, what can I do for that much XP? Um, Hokors? No, I don't feel quite that confident in my damage yet. Kobolds? Kobolds would be sensible. Ring Fling does not work. Uh, if it's different, it gives me hope. Worth testing. It's not a damage rider the way Lightning Charges and Callous Glow are. Uh, I'm doubtful, but we'll see. It's been almost 12 hours. I just want to hit level 6, man. Dream in red. I, I have this bad habit of going for benchmarks that I'm... I'm I'm used to structuring streams around, but like I'll decide to go for that benchmark nine hours into a stream. The level 12 wrong. Oh, sorry. My bad. Words are uh, hard. What? What do you mean, too drunk? It's not possible. I mean, I should switch back from that immediately. At least things have stayed interesting. The Rogue playthrough. Good luck, Rogue's ass. Rogue is not ass. Rogue is just not suited to soloing uh, encounters where you're face tanking things. Rogue is a good class. What makes you say rogue's ass? Rhymed. If everyone What's else your... minds their business, I'll be fine. Do I want to handle this? Not for solo playthroughs, great parties. Yeah, definitely hard to manage in solo. Requires a lot more, uh... Fiddling. Death won't take me yet. That's a friendly looking shadow. These boots have seen everything. I just magic missile through here. Never thought to do that. Can I throw at those? Oh, come on, Larry, and that would have been so sick. Oh, can I use my bow? No, so I can't see what a magic missile can. Not multi-classing, you get one attack, which is kind of not great. Requires a uh, careful position. Position. Maybe, maybe if I climb on top of something. Is there anything I can stand on here? Any, any stand onables? I didn't bring my own footstool either. I could probably make a void bulb hit them. Breathe deep and move. Really boring? Ah, I'm, I'm not bored, but uh, I get it. The one that's sleeping, even though it's in psycho. Actually, let me go for this one that's sleeping. Out of sight, out of mind. Never wanted the easy path. Don't want to draw any attention. I'm sure, you're bored having played 12 hours straight of it. Oh, yeah, sorry. 
Dwarf Race gets invis cantrip. Uh, Dwarf Guard just get invis on demand uh, outside of combat, and yeah, once inside of combat. Real good. Correct and pass the stall check. Yeah, I broke my Dwergar invis, got the kill, got my Death Soccer mantle invis, so it looked like it never dropped. auto crit sleeping enemies so i can just do enough damage to kill them best be on my way keep thinning them out this way just out of view this one might live and this one lives Reeks of spirits. but surprise 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 the level need to find a way forward I don't have any advantage anymore but it's fine back up a little close the door running hide dash light on my feet Almost 12 hours again, rope must be fun. I'm enjoying it. It's very tactical. I can't, like, infinite actions... You know, nuke things down in combat the way I'm used to. I have to figure out how I can kill things in the first two attacks, period. Or how I can minimize enemy threat as a whole. Or how I can pick things off. It's, uh... Very, very tactical. Amusingly, I think Rogue would be one of the, the choices if you were doing something like a no damage run, although some fights would be complicated. The rat way, yes, the rat way. Yeah, create water, lightning bolt, ice storm. Uh, I have water bottles, and I can use lightning bolt scrolls. That stuff's still on the table. Ish. Level 6. So, 5 of Rogue gives me a stronger sneak attack, and it gives me uncanny dodge. What's, um, what's Rogue's level 6 feature? Let me actually check. Expertise. Expertise and 2 skills. That could be useful for talking through some of the thorns, but meh. Seven will be evasion, which allows me to do things like fireball my feet safely. A rogue's get an additional feet at level 10. So I'll be able to have Tavern Brawler and something else at 10 if I go pure class. We're thinking about. Sneak attacks now 3d6. If not over, then through. All right, time to skulk about. This visual bug. I want you to I want to close it from this side. 
going to close it from this side. Can you, can you not? Apparently not. Apparently not. Wonder if the gods are watching me. Any more are you sleeping? This one's just chilling. Plan that better. That's fine. First step is the hardest. I'm invisible again. It don't matter. Love how you're rogues. You're playing like a rogue. Such patience. Hats off. I'm glad you're enjoying it, Jaws man. Jaws. Part of the fun is like each run feeling like I'm playing a different class. Sometimes I slip into habits of, okay, this tech works well, I, I do this here. But I've been trying to diversify. Don't get detected, Shovel. to rat anymore. Alright then. Burger slip to invis as many times as they want. Uh you can only do it once in each combat, but outside of combat I can do it as many times as I want. And exiting combat lets me use it again in the next one. The only downside is you have to concentrate, but that is the only downside. Maybe I need more pockets. They never do that. Dwergar have really good features. Like it's so good. They have superior dark vision, so like all the other underdark races, they get twenty-four meters instead of twelve. Which is very impactful inside of Act 2 in particular. Um, like all dwarves, they're poison resistance. Uh, dwarven combat trainings, proficiency with battle axes, hand axes, light hammer, war hammer. Good stuff. Uh, resistant to charm. Just really, really good features. Dwergar... Dwergar is up there with Zariel Tiefling, competing for the title of strongest player race. It's between those two. 
I'd be like, I'll just stream a couple more minutes 12 hours later. Also, hi, I'm home from work. Hi, Ember. How was your day? There's the fourth one. Gotta get my boss my two week notice. Let's go. Let's have a look. That sounds like a, uh, a satisfying day. Do a verbal altercation. Knowing you, they deserved it. Stupid. Wait, no, it, it is open. Could be a good thing. What is with this game and doors? doors are messed up for me then too do you eat anything during longer streams uh sometimes sometimes i have this bad habit of uh, not eating because uh i i don't really experience hunger strongly uh how my body works i just forget sometimes i did take a break and eat earlier um but seeing as how it it's been 12 hours. I'm gonna cut it off here. Hey, Red Rum. How's the road run coming along? Uh, it's been a lot of fun. It's been a lot of fun. Really, really enjoying it so far. Very strategic. Uh, very slow paced. Very tactical. But uh, it's it's been cool. We made a lot of progress. We hit level 6 already. Um, Level 6 on day 1 is pretty, pretty good. Uh, we're 20 strength. Yeah, we've, we've made excellent progress. I'm thinking tomorrow... We, um, Mason's Guild, then Balthazar, get access to Callus Glow, and then figure out what we kill from there. Yeah, that'll be it for today. Uh, thank you so much, everybody, for hanging out. Hope you had a wonderful time. I'll be live tomorrow, business as usual. Um, trades playing, uh, Paladin on Honor. Solo Honor Paladin. Uh, now... You know how we feel about Paladin here. <laughs> um, Trade gets it, but uh, Trade is actually the person who did a lot of the groundwork for how I plan on doing a lot of this rogue run. A lot of the strats that I decided on came from watching him. Um, so, yeah, we'll head over there. Uh, thank you so much, everybody. Uh, if you've been enjoying the content and you're not already following, consider dropping a follow. It's completely free. Um, and it gives you notifications when I'm live and whatnot. And if you got your monthly Prime sub, that is also free to you if your Amazon account is linked to your Twitch, etc., etc. You get the deal. I'm tired. Goodbye. <laughs> See you tomorrow.